people, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the Madden Ballers YouTube channel and our Detroit Lions franchise. Week 5 this season here, Detroit's back at home in Ford Field taking on the 3-1 Buffalo Bills. Last week the Lions were in New Jersey taking on Michael Vick and the Jets. They scored a last minute touchdown but could not convert the two point conversion to tie the game and lost to the Jets 28 to 26. Jeremy Ross is back to return the opening kickoff for the Lions. We'll find out who's gonna win this game coming up next. Back his own end zone. Jeremy Ross takes the kickoff from the one out past the 15, trying to get outside but stopped short of the 20 and that's where the Lions will start at the 19 yard line Kevin Cobb the guy we picked off picked up in the preseason to take over for the injured Matt Stafford who didn't start the first three games of the year because he had to learn the playbook comes out for his first start of the season after Stafford was re-injured last week against the Jets he picked pitches this one out to Reggie Bush who gets outside has the first down and more and he is out to the 36 yard line, a 17 yard gain on the play. Later on in the drive, it's third down and nine. Cobb fakes the handoff, looking to throw, fires deep and way off the mark there. Believe that one was intended for Calvin Johnson and the Lions have to punt. The Bills take over here, EJ Manuel, the quarterback for the Bills completing 69.5% of his passes on the season so far. He'll start out in the shotgun and hand off to Fred Jackson who gets outside, has the first down as he breaks some tackles, pushed out of bounds at the 41, a 15 yard gain on the ground. Later on in the drive, it's second and three for the Bills. Manuel passes to Chandler here for the first down catch and that puts the Bills in Lions territory as Chandler's flopping around there celebrating. Second and six now, handoff to Bryce Brown, who's gonna break a tackle, has the first down, down the sideline, can't tell it, catch him. No, he does not, he tackles him into the end zone. Touchdown, Buffalo. Bryce Brown, I believe that was 41 yards on the rush, and the Bills take a seven to nothing lead. The Lions take over here, first and 10. This pass from Kevin Cobb, way off the mark. He's 0 for three here early on. Third and 10 now. Cobb back to pass. His pass is set up for a screen to Joyke Bell, who has it, but will not find the first down marker. Four yards on that catch, and the Lions have to punt. The Bills take over here, second and seven. Manuel back to pass, shakes off a tackle, finds Scott Chandler up at the 50. That's good enough for a first down. And the drive will continue for the Bills. First and 10 from the Lions 34. Hand off to Jackson up the middle. He will go for about seven yards on the rush. Third and three now for Buffalo. Manuel back to pass here. He's gonna dump it off to Fred Jackson who stopped behind the first down marker by Tulloch. And that's gonna force a field goal and Buffalo takes a 10 to zero lead. Lions have the ball again, Joyke Bell on second and four, up the middle, he will go, that's a gain of 12 and a first down for the Lions. Later on in the drive, it's second down and 11. Cobb back to pass, firing and looking for Calvin Johnson, but it's broken up and Lions have third and 11 now from the 48. Cobb back to pass, he's hit and his pass falls incomplete and the Lions will have to punt once again. And at the end of one quarter, the Bills have a 10 to nothing lead over the Lions. Buffalo punting to start the second quarter here as they have fourth and one. The kick is back and Ross is back his own 14 yard line, returning this one past the 20, cuts outside, gets up to the 31 yard line. And that's where Kevin Cobb and the Lions will take over here, second and eight. Hand off to Reggie Bush. Up the middle, he will go for a gain of eight yards on the play. Short of the marker, but they would eventually get that. First and 10 now. Cobb back to pass here. Over the middle for Calvin Johnson. He has the catch up to the 49. That's a seven yard gain on the play. Third down and two now for the Lions at the 50. Cobb will hand off to Reggie Bush and he's gonna be stopped behind the marker short of the first down and the Lions will have to punt. 
EJ Manuel and the Bills take over here. And we have a flag already on the play as this pass to Sammy Watkins is caught up past the 30 to about the 31. And it looks like a face mask penalty. The Bills have third and three now here from the 38 hand off to Bryce Brown who has the first down up to the 45. And they can celebrate another first down later on the drive. It's second down and 10 from the Lions, 25. Hand off to Bryce Brown trying to get outside here and he will be brought down at the 18. That's a seven yard gain on the play. They would eventually pick up that first down. First and 10 now from the 14. Hand off to Brown. Outside he goes and he's gonna make his way into the end zone for the second time today. And the Bills take a 17 to nothing lead over the Lions here in the second quarter as we look at the replay of the touchdown. Brown not even touched on the play. Kevin Cobb and the Lions taking over now. He's rushing out of the pocket and sacked on the play is Cobb. A loss of 18 yards. Third and 18 now for Detroit. Cobb back to pass. Firing deep for Golden Tate. He has the catch, but it's short of the marker and the Lions punt once again. Minute 20 left in the half as EJ Manuel and the Bills take over this pass deep to Robert Woods is caught for the first down. A flag on the play, I believe face mask penalty gives the Bills the ball at the 43 of Detroit, third and 15. And this pass is picked off by DeAndre Levy over the middle and he's gonna return this one to the 42 yard line. Detroit takes over there and they're making a switch at quarterback. Kellen Moore in the game now for Detroit. And his first pass over the middle to Eric Ebron is good. Up into Bills territory at the 22 yard line. First and 10 now from the 22. Moore out of the shotgun here looking to pass. He's gonna fire this one deep to the sideline caught by Calvin Johnson. And that one is inside the 10, down at the eight. First and goal, Detroit. Kellen Moore out of the shotgun now looking to pass. Firing this one to the end zone for Calvin Johnson. He gets both feet in and the Lions score right before halftime to make it 17 to seven Buffalo. At the end of the first half here, we'll take a look at your first half stats here in a second. As Buffalo, 119 yard rushings in the rushing yards in the first half, and Detroit 75 yards passing. The Lions made a switch at quarterback right before the half, and it worked out just fine. Kellen Moore, three for three, and a touchdown there to end the first half, and the Lions trail 17 to seven. As EJ Manuel will be sacked on the first play of the second half. Third and 13 now for the Bills. Manuel back to pass, looking, and his pass falls incomplete at the feet of Fred Jackson. And the Lions force a three and out here to start the third quarter. And Moore in the Lions take over here. This pass to Golden Tate is caught for a first down up to the Bills 31 yard line. And they are in business again, already in field goal range for Nate Freeze. Second and 12 now for the Lions. Moore back to pass is gonna be sacked on the play. And that's gonna be a big loss. Third and 20 upcoming. Moore out of the shotgun. Back to pass, he's gonna to try to hit Calvin Johnson, but it is deflected. And the Lions will have to punt the ball after that deflection. Pinning the Bills back their own two yard line. First and 10. This pass out to Robert Woods is dropped incomplete. And it'll be third down and eight now from the Bills four yard line. EJ Manuel handoff to Fred Jackson trying to just give their punter some room here. And he does not make it to the first down marker. So the Bills would punt. Detroit will take over from their own 49 yard line. First and 10. Kellen Moore gonna hand it off to Joyk Bell. And he's not gonna get back to the line of scrimmage or he does. And later on, it is third and one. Moore will hand off to Bell up the middle. He squeezes through the line, sticking with this running game, as that's what they need to do if they want to win these games. And Bell gets the first down. And later on in the drive, it's second down and nine. Moore is going to fake the handoff, fire, and hit Calvin Johnson down to the 22 yard line. First down, Detroit. Second and six now for the Lions. Moore under center. Is gonna fire deep to the end zone for Calvin Johnson, incomplete. 
He thought Megatron could go up there and get it, and he didn't even give an effort to jump up for that ball. Third down and six now. Moore back to pass, firing for Kevin Ogletree, wide open, but the pass is offline, and the Lions settle for a 35-yard field goal attempt. Nate Freeze's kick is up, and it is good, and it's 17 to 10 now. Lions down by only a touchdown as the Bills take over. Fred Jackson will get the handoff here, trying to get outside, but taken down after only a two-yard gain on the play. Third and eight now for the Bills. E.J. Manuel back to pass, steps up, and he is pressured and sacked by Nick Fairley on the play, and that'll force a punt from the Buffalo Bills. The Lions take over from their own 39-yard line. Second and 10, handoff to Reggie Bush, trying to get outside. Breaks one tackle, but taken down behind the line, a two-yard loss on the play. So third and long upcoming here. Empty backfield, Moore back to pass, firing deep downfield, double coverage, and it's picked off by Williams. He's gonna take this one past the 40, back up towards midfield, taken down at their own 48, and that's where Buffalo will take over here. Second and eight from the 50. Manuel hand off to Fred Jackson, getting outside, breaking a tackle, and getting taken down short of the marker, but he fumbles the ball, and Jason Jones for the Lions recovers it. And the Lions have the ball, but wait, hold on, there's a booth review here. And take a look at this one. Decide for yourself, it looks like Fred Jackson was down before the ball came out, and the ref comes out and reverses the call. Buffalo keeps it, and they have third and two now from the Lions 44. Handoff to Bryce Brown, he's got the first down up to the 40 yard line and the drive will continue for Buffalo. And you can see at the end of three quarters, Buffalo still on top, 17 to 10. Buffalo trying to finish off this drive to start the fourth quarter and extend their 17 to 10 lead as EJ Manuel on first and 10 will go down and then Avika and Sue with the sack. Third down and five now for the Bills. Handoff goes to Fred Jackson, and he's got his first, got the first down for the Bills, down to the 13. And the upcoming schedule for the Lions, they are at the Vikings next week. First and 10 for the Bills, handoff to Jackson, up the middle, breaking tackles, taken down at the eight yard line. And it'll be third down and six now for Buffalo. Manuel out of the shotgun, looking to pass, fire into the end zone, and broken up by Darius Slay. And Buffalo has to settle for a field goal to make it 20 to 10. The Lions take over with under 10 minutes to go. Kellen Moore back to pass here, firing deep to the sideline, caught by Golden Tate for 14 yards on the play, setting up third and 10. Kellen Moore out of the shotgun here, looking to pass. Steps up, throws deep for Golden Tate. He has the catch and more. Breaks a tackle and into Buffalo territory down to the Buffalo 35-yard line. First and 10, Detroit. Moore, empty backfield, back to pass. Fires quickly to Calvin Johnson. He has the catch and the first down. And the Lions are on the move here up at the Buffalo 23. Another shotgun set for the Lions. Moore will hand off to Reggie Bush up the middle. He's going to go. And he makes his way all the way to the first down marker to the 13. Later on in the drive, it is second and seven from the 11. Handoff to Bush up the middle. He has the first down and more, fighting his way down to the Buffalo two yard line. First and goal, Detroit. Moore comes to the line under center here. He will hand this one off to Reggie Bush, trying to get outside, but he stopped at the line. And that's no gain. Second and goal for Detroit. Moore will look to pass, and a quick dump off to Eric Ebron is caught for the touchdown. And Detroit gets within a field goal now, 20 to 17. Buffalo still on top as the Bills take over here. And the handoff to Bryce Brown up the middle will go for the first down in the Lions territory. Second down and 12 for Buffalo now. Manuel back to pass, steps up. Looks like he wants to take off, but he is sacked by Sue, his second one on the day. And Buffalo will have third and 17 after this Detroit timeout. Third and 17 now for the Bills. 
They need that first down to keep the clock going. And Emmanuel will be sacked again on the play. And Detroit takes another timeout here before the two-minute warning, trying to get the ball back down by three. And hopefully these timeouts work as they only have one left and the ball. Moore back to pass. We'll find Reggie Bush over the middle for a medium gain there as they hurry up to the Lions. Second down and five for the Lions. And Moore will be passing once again here, firing, looking for Calvin Johnson who cannot hang on to the ball. And it'll be third and five after the two-minute warning here from the 22. Empty backfield. Moore back to pass, firing for Golden Tate. And he cannot come down with a catch. It'll be fourth down and five. And the Lions have to go for it. Moore out of the shotgun here looking. Firing to Calvin Johnson on the slant play. He has the catch up to the 36-yard line. And the Lions have to hurry back to the line to get this drive going. First and 10 from the 36. Moore back to pass. Surveying the field. Fire to the sideline and caught by Golden Tate. He has the first down, but the clock continues to move, and the Lions only have one timeout. They hurry back to the line, first and 10 from the 48. Moore back to pass, finds Calvin Johnson on another slant play, and it's another first down for the Lions. The clock continues to move with another minute to go. Kellen Moore will hand off to Reggie Bush on the delay up the middle. He has the first down and Moore up to the 26, and the Lions will hurry up once again to the line, Second down and 10. Moore back to pass here. Firing and caught by Kevin Ogletree at the 13. And the Lions hurry up once again to the line, saving that timeout in case they need to kick a field goal. As Moore is back to pass, he drops back. Fires for Jeremy Ross, and it's offline incomplete. 18 seconds left now for the Lions. It's second and 10. Moore back to pass, throws this one up to the end zone, and it's caught by Joseph Fourier. Can you believe it? He caught it and got inside the pylon as we take another look at this nice pass. Lobbed it up for Fourier, and he just got inside the pylon for the touchdown, and Detroit takes a 24-20 lead. Fourier's only catch of the day goes for the game, uh, game going ahead touchdown. That's how you want to say it. And the Bills have one more shot. Five seconds left. Second and 16. E.J. Manuel back to pass. Steps up here. And he will take a sack. And that will end it. Detroit gets the comeback victory after Kellen Moore comes in the game late in the first half. 24 to 20 your final score. And the Lions improve to 3 and 2 on the season. Three hundred twenty-three yards of total offense, ninety-six on the ground, two hundred twenty-seven through the air. Most of that come, coming from Kellen Moore once he came in the game. Kevin Cobb three for nine in the day. He was pulled there late in the first half after having a bad day. Reggie Bush eighteen carries, seventy yards. So another pretty solid day for Reggie Bush on the ground. Calvin Johnson, another solid day. Eight catches, 89 yards, and a touchdown. Also got touchdowns from Ebron and Joseph Fourier on the day. Steven Tulloch led the way with 10 tackles on the day. And the Lions improved to 3-2. Matthew Stafford still out for a couple more weeks, but Dan Orlowski will be off the injured list in a week. Will we bring him back and get rid of Kevin Cobb? We'll have to wait and find out. Coming up, the Lions travel to TCF Bank Stadium, I believe it is to face off against the Viking Vikings in outdoor weather for the first time since, believe, 1974. Both these teams, three and two. Who will come away with a win? You'll have to wait and find out. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and we'll catch you guys in the next episode.